This is KNEB.TV weather from the KNEB Storm Center, your trusted source for weather. We're going to be dealing with skies tonight that are partly cloudy, mostly cloudy, a thunderstorm around early, and then things are going to clear out uh, as we go later on tonight. We do have a severe thunderstorm watch at, out until 9 o'clock tonight. We'll show you that in a moment. We do expect scattered storms tonight and again tomorrow. Then conditions are going to turn drier, and uh, temp's going to warm up as we get towards the weekend. 84 yesterday after a morning low of 56. One one-hundredth of an inch of moisture in the rain gauge, so we finally registered for the month of June, uh, but uh, that's it. Uh, one one-hundredth is almost two inches below normal for the year. Well, there's that severe thunderstorm watch that we showed you. It goes until 9 o'clock tonight. This does include uh, most of the Nebraska panhandle. It includes uh, basically areas along and north of the North Platte River Valley, Banner County, Goshen County, uh, Niobrara County, eastward into the North Platte, Broken Bow area. Greater risk of severe weather, I think, within this area, going to be right in here uh, is where we expect maybe a greater concentrated area of severe weather. Uh, and it's going to be early and then ending here across the region. You can see the temps are much cooler off to the north of us. 60s and rapid, uh, low 60s at that. 85 in Hayes, 87 in McCook right now, some heat there. 69 in Valentine, it's 83. Scotts Bluff 84 in Ogallala. Winds are 10 to 20 at times, especially off to the northwest of us with some gusts up around 25 an hour around the Lusk area. Well, I told you the severe weather threat right here close to home tonight. Uh, that is where we do have the severe thunderstorm watch out. Again, slight risk of severe weather tonight. Now, tomorrow, a couple of things going on. First of all, we do have a slight risk in far eastern portions of the panhandle, a marginal risk in the rest of the area. But uh, concerned about some areas here uh, where we have seen some indications of some stronger thunderstorms possibly developing tomorrow. And in fact, an enhanced risk of severe thunderstorms in areas along and south of I-80 there from North Platte over to Kearney, Grand Island and down towards Lincoln. Again, an enhanced risk of severe storms there. That all moves out for Wednesday as we dry out here across the region. So future cast shows a couple of light showers and thunderstorms around early this evening. Only partly cloudy skies. Lows overnight that are going to fall down right into the well, about 50, 55 overnight for a low. Pretty comfortable out there. Now tomorrow we start the day with a few clouds. We'll clear out just in time to reprime the pump. Set the stage for another round of thunderstorms. Again, some of these going to be strong to severe, especially just to the east of us. We're dealing with a pretty good threat of severe weather tomorrow. Again, just to, to the south and east of us uh, from North Platte over towards Lincoln. Uh, otherwise, we're going to be dealing with temps tomorrow cooler in the north. Uh, even cooler in all the rest of the region, 70s, uh, but a few areas there in the northern panhandle up into the 60s. As far as precip goes, we are going to see some from tonight and tomorrow, uh, maybe a quarter to a half an inch in a few areas. Could see a little bit more in, in areas, less in others. Get under some of these isolated bands, though, and uh, an inch or two not out of the question. So tonight we're going to see scattered strong to severe storms early, 56 for a low, Rinse and repeat for tomorrow, a little cooler, but another round of strong to severe storms on the way. Upper 70s for your high. Our seven-day forecast on Wednesday, we're being about 80 or so. Then Thursday, Friday into the mid and upper 80s. And then look at Saturday, Sunday right now. Hot weather returns to the region. We've got temps into the mid-90s out there. And then on Monday, back to near 90. So, again, a warm-up coming for this weekend as we get ready to uh, get into the uh, – Another weekend here in the month of June.